welcome back to the Big Ski family. This week was a big one. It was very, very crazy. So our family pretty much split into like a million different directions. But before we did so, we had an awesome field trip to Pacific Vision Center. And it was an aquarium in Long Beach that was absolutely next level. I mean, from the architecture to the building, to the species of fish that they had, and the like live interaction, there was awesome theaters and more educating where you can see things um, so you could rest your feet and sit down for a while. It was just amazing. We had such an awesome time. We came home that night and then we found out that my oldest sister, Catherine Joy Bober, was in labor with her third baby. Okay, now Katie is like a baby machine. She's had all three of her children in two years and four months. Crazy. So her oldest just turned two in February. She's a little one-year-old that turned one in March and then she just had this one in June. Crazy enough, she had this baby on the same day as our youngest sister, Cordelia May which her birthday is June 22nd. So that was kind of crazy because Cordy was also turning seven at the same time as her newest little nephew was being born. So my mom has a tradition of going up and helping Katie after her labors and after her birth because she knows how hard it is. I mean, she's had 11, so she knows how that recovery process can be hard. And so she's up there just helping with the kids and making meals and taking a load off Katie's shoulders. Hey, Cordy. What are you doing? so much fun. This Baylor's car Whoa. is more fun than a Ferrari. Don't tell Ken that. Yeah. You should have said that, Mama. She's a crazy. She drifted. <laughs> Why Mama started doing this whole tradition of coming and seeing her daughters after they gave birth was because 
um, my father's mother, Grandma Paula, she would always come to my mom's birth and help after my mom had another child as well. And mama knew how much of a help that was and so she wanted to give her daughters the same exact experience. So that's what mom is doing. Daddy is a strategic coach. He's been coaching and working hard and he has also been gone this whole week. So what does that leave us with? It leaves us with me and my six younger siblings. Well, I guess only five because Cordelia went up with my mother to also help out with grandkids. So we were like, let's go down to Valley Center and visit our cousins and our Uncle David and Aunt Jody. Ivan, is that a rattlesnake? Yeah. Yeah, it's a dead rattlesnake. Yeah, was it pestering the dogs last night? No, it wasn't. It, I don't know if it During those few days that we were there, myself, Kimberly, Chloe, and my older cousin, Amanda, went to a roaring 20s party. It was a graduation party for a couple of my friends, and it was so awesome, so well themed. We had an absolute blast, so that was an awesome night. Also got to have a beach trip which was super fun we went down to Carlsbad Beach did some boogie boarding and although it was overcast and really chilly we ended up having a great time looking sandy looking full After a wonderful time down in Valley Center with my Uncle David and Aunt Jody's family, we drove up to St. Clemente for the remainder of our time, which I guess that's three more days before we go back. Um, and we're hanging out with Aunt Jolinda's family. And so we're having a blast down here. The kids are playing at the beach. It's always awesome to visit family. We've really just had a ball. So that's kind of been our week down here. We've been just six kids taking on California by ourselves. And it's been awesome. We've been having a great time. We cannot wait to see our parents. We miss them so much because as I said, it's, it will have been a full week, actually a little over a week. 
and we miss you mom and daddy so much but we know you guys have been having great experiences where you are and we've had an awesome time too so that kind of wraps up this week don't forget to subscribe hit that notification button we love hearing your comments and yeah we'll see you guys next week